don't know, I think 20 is a pretty good start. Let's see. Crunch. Oh my gosh, there's so many clones. Okay. Hmm. Moon. Okay, okay, hold on. Hold your horses a second now. I need to think about what we're doing. Okay. If we need a universe, that means one universe would require five galaxies. Five galaxies. We're going to go all the way back if we have to. It's going to require 22 solar systems. Two solar systems. <laughs> no, 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 no. 22. 22 solar systems is going to require 1,375, let's see, 138, is that right? Okay, 1,375, of course some of the Earth-like planets are going to need more, so uh, let me see, I need 14 Earth-like planets, which is going to require me to have an extra Ten of these. Okay, now to make a thousand three hundred planets is going to require fifty-three moon. Uh, it's gonna be about half price. Okay, so a uh, little more than half price. We'll call it seven fifty. It's close enough. Okay, so a hundred moons again, about half price. About half price on the uh, nights. So, oh, I don't know. This is more than we need. Uh, we'll split the difference. It's close enough again. However, these require slightly more skies. Okay. Skies require half price on weather, so we'll call that 200. Weather requires half price on continents. Now, oceans are a little bit messy, two and a half times, but you also eat oceans, so we'll call it triple. So we need about 600 oceans. Now, how about nations? Uh, hmm. Uh, let me see. Wait, I have an exact number. I need 264. Okay. All right. Now, uh, presumably we'll need a not, lot of towns. We can probably get away just buying the towns. Um, probably. Okay. Follow this chart for me, would you? And we'll see how far it gets. Hopefully pretty far. Anything more expensive than a town we make by hand for the huge discounts. Hmm. Okay. Here comes the sky. Here comes the sun. Do 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 do. We're not there yet, but I just had to. Okay. Come on, one more batch. Okay. Okay, moons. Okay, here goes all of our. Yeah. And this is gonna be a fortune. Hmm. In the meantime, make rocks. Make rocks happen. What did I just do with all my clones again? I just had them. Oh, yes, of course. Uh, so I might as well make one of these just because it's cheap. Um, it'll make a minute. To take, take, a, take a moment to do this a little. Spend half of what's left on this. Another half over here. I only want one universe. 
How long will it take? So the first hour, the answer is nope, not yet. There's not really much. Even gathering more of this won't speed it up any, of course. All right. Well, let's head back over here. I guess it would actually be easier just to do it like this. You know what? It's not close enough. It's never close enough. It must be exact. Okay. Now we look good. Hmm. I'll just put you lot there. Actually, I might have a need for you over here. Crunch. Oh, look at that. I haven't even used weather or anything yet. Huh, I almost take down a pee ball. I haven't used a weather or anything. Don't worry about that sort of stuff last. So, 20 and 1 hour only brought us to 300 moons. Less than half our total moonage. But you see, each planet requires twice as much stone as a moon, and I need almost twice as many. So, if I'm right, I need about eight times as much just to get the planets. Then the suns are, of course, even more expensive each. I'm not even sure how much they cost, but um, I think we're going to need to get to the word better in our divinity if memory serves. At the very least. So, we'll up this a few more ranks. Uh, you know what? I'm going to take a moment to do this. Also, I'm going to throw some moons and skies. In. Okay, at this point, yeah. I mean, it costs two divinity apiece. I often, I get kind of in the habit of clicking this button. I try to remind myself to actually make stuff. But now that I'm dealing in numbers like this... Ah, uh, we good. There we go. Four ranks in capacity. I only have to poke in every half an hour. This sounds good to me. But now I have to balance it again. Uh, such hard work. Nobody understands my struggles. Having to make make these numbers equal. All right, anyway, uh, so. A moon, only two ninety nine. Shop smart, shop S smart, in space. Okay. So. Yeah. The next time, in an hour from now, I'll be able to get three hours worth of gain out of these. You know, I probably made a mistake. I should have gone with the battle module. Then I could have had a little boost to my uh, divinity gain instead of my building speed. Still, building speed's not terrible. I mean, I'm just talking about what's going to be a 3% because I don't want to chew them all up just yet. Hmm. I don't know. I think... I think I might be able to complete this in three hours. If I can complete a challenge in three hours... What's the bonus again? A boost to my planet level, I think? I mean, holy crap. If I could complete the challenge that quickly... Um... Then maybe I'd want to spam that. I mean... How many, how many challenge points are they worth a piece? Uh. Hmm. Ultimate Universe Challenge. Three. Max 45. Uh, how many Ultimate Universe Challenges have I done? Three. What? Hold on. What? What is the black hole challenge? 
I need to figure something out here for Huh? Bonus 125? Whoa! Nobody said anything about a bonus! Well, thank you! So completing a challenge all the way gives me bonus challenge points. So each double rebirth challenge was worth five. An alternate universe challenge, if I understand this right, is only worth one? And the black hole challenges are worth two. Why is Double Rebirth given such a such a nice bonus? What about Skippy? I'm currently at 48. I've done six of them, so they're worth eight apiece. So the skip challenge might be the most efficient way to gather challenge points right now. Hmm. On the other hand, being able to nail this challenge over and over again quickly is really attractive, I must say. Um, that is really tempting. We'll see how fast I can do it, exactly. Hmm. There's those pet challenges. I really should do another pet universe and ball, day ball, day pet, day universe type challenges. With my newfound prowess, I should excel at them. And my pets should get more out of their food. Only the fanciest of... Hmm. Bad at all campaigns. Also, the rock, it's a pet. Good at multiplier, good in level. Specifically, the phoenix and the pegasus. But the phoenix, because it's cool. Uh, good in multiplier. Anybody good at growth campaigns? Good at all, but you're out of reach. No, the next time I do get a pet token... Nobody who's really good at growth again. Well, I mean, the slime's good and all. I'll get him soonish. He's That's the other thing I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about pee balls. I'm thinking about skips. I'm thinking about ultimate universes now. <sighs> thinking about challenge points. Thinking about a lot of things. I don't know what I'm doing next. I ain't decided. I ain't yet made up my mind. Uh, fix. You mustn't be below a hundred. Gah. Well, the day universe challenge would help a little bit with this in its own way. Actually, if I was to do those short runs I talked about, it would be very good indeed to get a high score on that. I bet I could now. Hmm. Hmm. Well, anyway. I can slip in a little bit more on you guys. Yeah. Alright, well, we'll see what this looks like at the next mark. Let's just scoop up these. So I decided 33 was good enough. Let's go ahead and knock out you. And knock out you. And let's see. I need one, two, three more. I'm about to get one of those. So basically two more of these. So... A little less than 20 minutes, and I'll have all the crystals up to level 9. As I've mentioned before, going past level 9 is kind of a pain, so that's pretty much optimum for me. Oh, wait a sec. Why didn't I do this sooner? Poof. Should have done that a while ago. 
Ah, well. Okay. Is it enough, though? I made my planets. I just need the suns. Now we can play the Beatles song, Here Comes the Sun. Wrong button. A hundred of them. A hundred of them smack bang done. Excellent. We still have a goodly amount of divinity left to us. Wait. Uh, you guys can uh, work on togs. They're cheap enough. Okay. So. Man, these used to take more than half an hour. Now it's about 15 minutes. I suppose I could buy even more creation speed. I really should, actually, uh, invest in a couple thousand percent more. Uh, but we're not going to do that at this moment. Uh, my budget's worn a little thin, and I need to get battle in there too soon. Uh, I mean, as well. Because, uh... Well, we're going to get to the bottom of this, probably within the next rebirth. And, you know, it's good. I suppose I'll be able to feed you now. Uh, not quite enough. I need more ball power if I'm going to feed my pets. I really do need some of that weather. Yeah, because each one of you costs three. So I need at least 45 ball. Okay, I won't get that much. But hey, I'll get some of it. So at least some of my pets can be fed. Hmm. Hmm. I cannot afford the remaining 27 suns at present. I see that now. Well, I plan on waiting another 20 minutes anyway. Would that be enough? I'm not sure. You know what? I'm just going to do this. I'm becoming a spendthrift. There you go. Push on through. Okay, with that, that's all all the stops. Yes, all the stops. I saw 532 suns here for a second. Went, whoa, and then I'm like, no, 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 no. That's because it's because it's, it's that number. No, it's 22. 22 is what they'll actually be making, and we got the supplies. So everything should just come together at this point. Crunch, crunch, crunch. So we're gonna check, make sure the solar systems. Once the solar systems go, I know I've, I know for certain, for fact, it's done. And that would put us at about three and a half hours. Uh oh, we need more Earth-like planets. No biggie deal. I can make a few. Uh, I've still got not much. That's a problem. Hmm. Not enough. Not satisfactory. We gotta be close. We gotta be close. Hmm. Anyway, I'm looking at about a three and a half hour run. I had to spend one GP. I also, I didn't mention, I did a one hour divinity run with some of my pets. The ones who weren't doing a growth. I can probably streamline this a little further. Maybe I take the Divinity Generator a couple more steps. I'm not positive. But the idea is that about the same time these crystals finish, which we're about 15 minutes out from, I'll also have the universe and... Uh, 
I'll be able to make my pets do a three-hour growth campaign and just spend about half an hour powering up. Well, I mean, some of them will do growth campaigns. Some of them will probably want to do something else. So that would be ideal. To do that, though, it's apparent I'll either have to be willing to fork over a couple GP, um, or be able to push this a little harder. Now, something interesting. Um, there's, there's a bunch of trade-offs. Okay. Let's say that I that this is a three and a half hour run. Okay, it's good for the pets, sort of. And it's good enough for the pets. They get one feeding, so they actually do get fed, and they get to do a growth campaign. Some of them. Uh, so it's it's okay for the pets, and because I'll be up here, I'll be getting them good food again. All right, so it'll be. It actually won't be bad at all for Divinity. Um, I mean, not super incredible, awesome, amazing, but it'll be okay. It'll be real good on... Uh, it'll be as good for Crystal Power as doing an actual Crystal Power challenge. Um, straight up. Challenge points, though, it's actually kind of really poor, actually. At one challenge point apiece for three and a half hours when as we've already illustrated five and a half will get you five from a double rebirth challenge unfortunately I've done all of those but still um, so that's that's a bit of a drawback there um, not a huge one though I mean I want challenge points I should spend my challenge points I have enough what do I want what do I want what do I want I want it all uh I only do think Crystal Power is the best deal on the table. I could try to save up to unlock a stone. The pet stones will actually impact the UPC. See, I found out only recently. Apparently, the pet pill thing is smoke and mirrors. Apparently, it's the number of pet stones. Now, it sounds weird to me, but that's what I was told. Uh, pet stones is directly proportional to the uh, growth that the pets gain. So, actually, this would be a 10% boost to the UPC, where none of these other things would impact that. A fairly good argument for pet stones. Otherwise, this is not... I mean, this is just not one of the good ones. Uh, I really do think... I mean, Divinity Gain now would help me with Ultimate Universe and with um, Black Hole Challenges. And Black Hole Challenges are another interesting thing. See, when I go to sleep or, you know, I'm otherwise indisposed for a longer period than three and a half hours, I can leave it set up on a Black Hole Challenge. And the black hole challenge, I'm not sure how long exactly it would take, but if I could get the black hole cost down, I think it's like 18 universes for the upgrade right now, and 23 galaxies, is that is that right? 23 galaxies, 18 in the universe, okay, yeah, that's right. Um, so, yeah. Um, if I could get the black hole challenge down low enough, Way down, so that the or the, the the price of a black hole and its upgrade are real cheap. Um, well, well, I'd like that. <laughs> Sorry to end so lamely, but I'd like that a lot. What? 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 Why'd you make a hundred of them? What the hell? You don't need a hundred of them. Excuse me. You wanted to make 22 solar systems. Yes? Oh, it was 14. Oh, my gosh. I don't know how I made that mistake, but look at this. Okay, look. See that? You only need to get this to 85. Right? Right. Oh, that botched this so bad. All right. So, 
what I need is what 36 is that right yeah that's right you got the moons okay all right so you do that and then you should be clear God ah ah all right all right all right 36 planets isn't that hard. We're supposed to be ending in like eight minutes. Well. Ah, just this once. I won't be such a spendthrift after this. Hey. Oh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, right, of course, because I left two pressed. It's okay. Oh, you can go back to having hundreds. I don't care now. Okay, everything is clear. God, I put a six or an eight or something there when it's supposed to be a 14. I don't know why. All right. Theoretically, this is all correct again. Good, good, good. Okay, so we got the challenge beat, uh, except that it'll take me actually um, 15 more minutes, a little more than that. When I'm already done in seven, <laughs> but that's okay. I uh, will also want to make some, oh, I have a lot of villages for some reason. I also want to make some weather. Uh, oh yeah, let's, let's hammer that out now because all the rest at this point, definitely all the rest of this um, divinity is just mad money to spend however I please. So I wasted some GP, but it's not a big deal. I gain GP on this run anyway. Um, for every P ball I knock down, I get more. I've still got an Unleash Might at the ready. All right. There you go. That's pretty nice growth. I don't know that I'll actually knock down another P ball, but I'll try. If I do, it'll be even more. So, yeah. That's what an Ultimate Universe challenge looks like at this point. I'm tempted to go with a black hole. I'm tempted to actually spam these. I'd just like to knock out another category, and I could do these. There's 45 of them. I could easily be knocking out um, four four of them a day and a black hole over the night. Okay, I'm not 100% sure on those black holes. They used to take a long, long time, didn't they? <sighs> hmm. Maybe I can take down another people. I don't know. Bloop, bloop. I mean, set you lot to work on this and you guys could be rapidly increasing my power here every 12 seconds I could go up a peg hmm. Hmm. yeah I do think I could take down another which is good because that would be more food for my pets okay it. Anyway, so that's how this one goes down. I think what I should do before I do anything else. Still got those. I've still got the God Skip challenges. I feel like I should knock out a few more while I'm down here before I go climbing way the hell up. And I can't help but feel that I should take the time to gather some more GP. I feel like I really should have some more in the bank. It's such a pain, though. Still, that 15 minute run was amazing. If. I could only work in some planets in that time. 
If I had planets, so I could knock that planet eater out. Oh yeah, that's the last, that's the other, other thing I have to do before we move on. Okay. You left me with 10 planets, very nice. I'll need 20 more. There it is. Okay, all the stuff's in play, but I want some more planets. Oh, that's the problem. Make me planets. Shit. No, I do have enough. Okay, good. I was worried. I was like, oh no, I don't have enough divinity to do it. I only wanted 20. As you were. Okay. With that, I can reach over here. Okay. Yeah, this eats down my creation. I'm creating poison. It's 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 good, right? Alright, I want ten. We're gonna see what two million clones can do if I bid them all against one of these. I bet this thing goes down real easy. Um, hold on a second. Uh, 49 seconds still, even with a million of them on it? Fine, I guess I'll only go for one rank. One. Still, it should go down easy. Even if I've only got that at, um, well, it'll be 52. It should still be more than good enough. With those kind of numbers back in it. Yeah, this is going to go great. And it'll double my power. So, yeah. Definitely take down this P-Ball. No problem. Okay done. All right. You're back to making a universe. Good, good. All right. All right. Where did I put them? Okay, right. Okay. Good, good, good. So this is one of the reasons I want I picked the uh, double rebirth challenge when I did was because I figured that 50 uh, would make this a lot more easier to do. Okay. Ultimate beings will increase by 102%? Why 102? Oh, well. Oh! Uh, oops. That's okay. I'll just do this. Okay, we're good? We're good now. So, uh, from what I've been hearing from all kinds of people, apparently there's ways to do this ridiculously efficiently. Uh, somebody was saying they could do it without even getting their clones killed somehow. I don't know how they do that. I've tried experimenting. Um, tried tried uh, doing aura balls uh, and different things. But I haven't actually done this since before the whole daily, the uh, double rebirth challenge stuff. So it's actually been a while. So... I want to open by giving him a planet. Okay? Because that doesn't boost him any. Then... Let's see if there's a way I can do this without getting damaged. I don't need the transformation or on mystic mode. The only way you could do that is with reflection barriers, but they're so expensive. I actually stopped using the uh, speed boost also. See, I could do that, but I'd, I'd run out real fast. I don't see how it could be done. He's going to score hits on me no matter what I do. So I'm going to go with an aura. Poison him. Mystic. Poison him. Set up a dodge. Planet. Okay. Just 
unescapable planet, right? Okay. Breathe. Okay, countered. You countered for one. Yeah, I did one damage. Poison. Okay, am I still... Am I still... Mystic? And transform? Let me see. Damage, you damage, damage reduction. Okay, damage reduction's gone down. Poison him again. Mystic. He also heals if you bring it down too far, I understand. Okay. That. Clairvoyance. Poison. Transform. Poison. Element. Mystic. Smash one! Double? This costs 30. This costs 113. Yeah, I should double. Smash! Okay. Plus. Smash! Mystic. I'm gonna need to breathe. Okay. Elemental manipulation. Smash! I should have used speed. Speed? Shit. Okay. Well, all right. Still, he's mostly broken. I'm healing. I should be able to come in again and finish him off. I feel like I could have battled that better. I need a couple more poison planets. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's also in the universe, isn't it? Uh, yeah, of course they would because I turned that thing off. Uh, pets! Half! Okay. Alright. Still. I'll get better at this. I'll get more GP. Uh, I've still got more planets back there if I need them. I don't think I need more than six poison planets on any particular run against him, but maybe I should have dragged him, tried to drag him a little further. I'm not sure where the threshold was. I thought it was at around 75%, uh, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong on that. Okay. You guys are done. Man, I wish these counted. You could certainly make an argument for spending your challenge points on uh, this one. <sighs> Getting a 10% boost would have maybe made all the difference there. But yeah, people, people with only a million can apparently beat multiple <laughs> levels down somehow. I don't know how they do it. Alright, is this enough to finish him off? Yes, definitely. But there's no kill like overkill. Am I right? Uh, okay, go back. <laughs> I feel like doing that. Okay, just let our well, as soon as our health touches the limit, we're going in. Okay. And you know what? We're burning the bridges behind us. We don't need any more clones. Just make the universe. Yeah. This has been a kind of a whole sloppy thing I've been doing. Okay. So have a good one. See, I did something nice for you. Now, why would you go and hit me after I did something nice? Now, I'm going to be mean to you. Okay, my plan was to be mean to you. Just period. Alright. Let's try super speed. Okay. Planet. Planet. 
clairvoyance, poison planet, breathe, oh good, I countered, poison planet, clairvoyance, cool, cool, wait, can I get a log to see what I've done? Shit. Uh. Uh. Sh shoot. I think it's give planet. I hope I didn't get it all mixed up. Okay, so I gave him a planet. Okay. Give him a poisoned planet. Give him a poisoned planet. Okay. Speed up. Okay. Crush. Horrible. Yay. Okay. There we go. Okay, that is excellent. No, I'm not going to try for that thing. All right. Universe is coming in. We got some GP. Um, go ahead and knock down uh, this fella here. I might as well just do that now. Crunch. Yeah, no chance on this one, though. I'm one-tenth as strong as you. A little, little more than that, actually. Okay. Bye. I could have six. Or... I could feed everyone puny food. Well, let's strike a balance. Somebody eats well. Yeah, I'll give you that. And... Somebody eats okay. Oops. And everybody else eats whatever they can get. There. One of them was given free food. I wonder who ended up with that. Who ended up shafted? Okay. The mole is over 2,500. Snake, camel, and goat. You three are all on the edge. But we're going to try to gather some GP after this. Oh. I don't need you guys there. Um, just uh, build up some monuments. That's good for me. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's just... It's good for me. Do that. Hmm. These are still the fastest to build right now. Hmm. We'll do that then. All right. I'm not going to make you sit around for seven minutes. You know what I'm doing next? Gathering GP. We'll see how well I can do that in 20 minute increments. Obviously, I'm going to want... A lot of battle backing me. Still iffy on the creating thing. I don't think I'm quite there yet, but if I can get a bit more on the creation count and speed, then probably. Hmm. Can I get a nice clean number here? Okay, thanks. Same for you. There. That's better. And you get the difference. Alright. Okay. Wait a sec. And I know I had a crap ton of villages sitting around. Might as well. Oh yeah. I can go over 20 now. Because I've been beating pee balls. Okay, there you go. See? Real good. That's not going to 
hold up long <laughs> when I'm grinding for a GP. Hey! Eh, 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 eh. No. Okay. It's fine. Well, I ran a few runs, but as you can tell, I wasn't attending it properly. I mean, this is the last one. I was AFK for like half an hour. But, you know, a little progress at least. Hmm. So. Now. What to do overnight? That is the question, isn't it? I don't have it set up to make crystals or do anything useful through the hours of the night. I could just let it keep running like this. I could just do a regular rebirth. I could do an ultimate universe and set it up and when I wake up I could have it. I really don't know how long a black hole takes. I have a feeling eight hours ain't gonna cut it. Ugh. But, you know, you'd have all of these, and you'd have a whole eight hours of po buffing this potentially, so maybe it could be done. Turn this on, all, all jammed up, wipe these out. Maybe. I'd be more confident if there was a divinity run in there with all of the pets. Hmm. And there's always that thing, and well, that's a three day challenge. I just don't think I can resist the siren call of the day challenges. <sighs> Shouldn't I gather a little more GP, and then with more GP? Hmm. Let's do the pet one. My pets deserve good food, and it's going to be hard to get them to level up much more, uh, better. Yeah, getting them across the 2500 threshold would, of course, let them get more. Hmm. But it also gives good GP. Okay, maybe that's not such a big deal anymore. I want to do this. But if I set up something so my pets, they're so close, an eight hour period would get even the camel across that threshold. And the snake and the goat, they're right on the edge. I could get them all over 2,500 tomorrow and then do the day pet challenge with everyone across that yeah okay that that's that's too logical an argument for me to find fault with so how about the day ball challenge well i have to double rebirth down which is unfortunate hp ball increases by level yeah you also received two x oh wait no that's the wrong one where did it, what uh, I was thinking of this one. Yeah, that one makes more sense. Um, I think I'm just going to do an Ultimate Universe challenge overnight. Oh, right. Ball power. Um, there you go. It won't let me even buy rocks with it until an hour passes. At least I think an hour passing is the catalyst. Yeah, okay. Ultimate Universe Challenge. Oh no, I need to cancel this. I'll never make it. What have I signed myself up for? Alright. Uh, psh. So, I'm going to set my pets, of course, to uh, a long growth, as I mentioned. I just need to get the Divinity Generator running, and so on and so forth. 17 more GP was that? I think. Ah, uh, well. Boop. But yeah, I'm gonna have to, uh. I'm gonna have to try harder with my, um. GP gathering at some point. Won't have time, I could be more attentive to it.
than that. Because, yeah, I know I can milk way more out of it, but it requires so much. It requires your full attention to do those short, short runs. But I would really like, well, there's several things I'd really like. I'd like three million clones. <laughs> yes, I'm that greedy. I'd like to get this to 150, actually, very much. Specifically for these ultimate universes, that would be handy. It, it really would. Um, I'll explain why in a second. See, at 150, the suns would be getting a full disc. It wouldn't be 100 and then a 38. It would just be 138. One go. The suns and the planets are what are most expensive in this. So I'd get a better discount on planets. I'd get a better discount on suns. Also, moons, nights, skies, weather, nations, oceans. Add all those discounts together, and it's a lot. It would help these Ultimate Universe challenges uh, quite a bit, I should think. If I had 150 count before I decided to spam them, it would, it would make it a lot smoother. Uh, I probably just need to learn to fight this thing better. But, you know, 50,000 more clones can never hurt. Adding a little, little more impact to my hits. It could be, it could work, it'd be good. Anyway. So. Generally. Great, I'm up too late as always. Generally, I let seven be selected. However, I also want food. That means I want the squirrel. See, he's one of the only things good at growth campaigns, so even though he gets good food and you get good food, but you're higher level, which in and of itself makes you better at growth campaigns. So, take those off. Oh, you're leveling the snake, are you? Well, okay. And you are really bad at food as well. See, these got, you've got... This one has minus 100% on finding food. This one's got minus 50% on finding food. So we want to grab somebody who can find food in place of one who does not. You'd think cats would be good at finding food because, you know, they bring home birds and mice and things all the time, right? Oh, well. Anyway, there's that set up. The snake will be complete. The mole is already complete. The goat is close. Anyway, the rest of them will find me food. And then I'll also smack around some pea balls for, e for even more mighty food in the mix. And uh, it'll just be good all around. Good times all around. So the only thing I need to stay up for now is just long enough to reach that uh, 2 million mark, which takes less time than the old uh, old 1 million mark did. Oh, boy. Just gather some. The other thing I'd do, I'd... Well, I really don't need to invest in creating speed, but I want to. Building speed multiplier would help with these as well because the divinity generator gets built. I mean, obviously. Basically, there's not a thing here that I don't want to buy. Well, okay, I don't care about uh, this right now. I don't care about um, changing my name or anything. I don't care for an alert button. So I guess there are a few things I don't care about, but still. Hmm. I could also start opening lucky draws. I have 31 of them. There could be something good in one. Yeah, there's not anything good in them, probably. Well, I mean, nothing amazing. There never is. Except for that one time when there was, and I got another crystal slot. That was nice. Well, anyway. 
Hmm. We're right on the edge of getting the universe. We're right on the edge of collecting our campaigns. We are... Eh. We're good enough on our crystals. Okay. So, Mr. Snake. Welcome to... The 2500 and up club. That leaves us with... A goat and a camel. Hmm. Well. How about the food? Eh, you guys didn't do so hot. I'm actually disappointed in you. Okay. Let's see. Let's trade up. I can do three. Boom, boom, boom. I can do 11. I could trade more stones. But you know what? I don't need these for anything. Let's just do it. Okay. 15. So. Get more out of the sour sauce again. Okay. Really, really close. Mm. I'll take that. You guys, you guys never really got the chance to uh, frolic and play with my shadow clones. We need to correct that. Okay, we've completed our universe, so we've completed our universe challenge. Do, 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 do. Good enough on the crystals. Uh, oh, there is something I can smash over here. Okay, uh, why not? Mmm. Ah. Give me that. Whomp. Okay. Hmm. Boop. Yeah, might as well. Might as well get those last couple drips in. And we're about ready to go nuclear. By which I'm in Super Saiyan. I could let them keep keep powering up. I could. Hmm. All right, let's hit this fella over here. Actually, let's look at this number. Shoot. Oh, come on. Work a little harder. You can do it. Yeah. Oh, man. So now the question is, what do we do with ourselves? Hmm. Hmm. What do we do with ourselves now? I want to keep gathering GP. I want to keep... <laughs> On the other hand, we're going to have more stuff released soon. Hmm. Let's go back down and do a few more skips. We only need two more pets, and then I'll be ready to hit this day pet. Ultimate ball. Uh, hmm. I think I should be winding down towards a skip. I'm going to try burning up my multi. 
and doing, I guess, a couple of skips. I need the GP rebanked. I have plans for it, but just getting it in the bank would be good. So, let's head down that path, shall we? Regular rebirths, short rebirths, much GP gained. 18 in the first, first 15 seconds. <laughs> and we're just getting started. Oh, there we go. Villages! Hmm, still can't go all the way to the bottom at the start. I miss having that power. But I love the speed at which we, we uh, make clones. And having twice the clones total is just, just amazing. Just, just awesome. All right. Hmm. You know what? I can leave that set like that. Anyway, gotta spend a little time. Gathering the GPs in, raking them in.